What's up, travelers? We're in Hanoi, Vietnam, and we are on our way to go get some egg coffee at the place that invented it. And then after that, we're going to find what kind of interesting food we can find ourselves. Alright, so we are sitting at Cafe Jean 39, which is the place that invented egg coffee. And they have a lot of different takes on the drink as it is on their menu, as you can see right here. Um, but let's get a little bit of history about this place. So back in the, the 30s and 40s, back during French colonization, milk was something that was uh, very hard to come by for the average person. It was really only allotted to the French aristocrats. It wasn't just available to anybody. So the owner of this place and founder of this place, he came up with the idea of using egg as a substitute for milk. And this is what we've got. All right, so here is the original egg coffee. And I ordered a second one, which is egg coffee with cacao. We're going to try them both out. Well, first things first, we got to try the topping. Oh, look at that. That is just wow. This is going to be so good. Yeah, the other places that I've been, they can do it pretty well, but they just, they just can't recreate this. This is, that's the best egg coffee in the world right there. All right, let's, let's give it a little stir and then drink it with the coffee mixed in. Man, it really it just doesn't get any better than that. But of course, we got still got this other one over there to try, so I might be lying about that. <laughs> So these are about 35,000 dong per cup, which comes out to about $1.50. And yes, I do highly recommend coming here and getting an egg coffee for sure. Now let's try the second one with the added cacao powder. Man, that is just chunky. <laughs> that is really something else. Give it another taste without the coffee involved. Mm. That is pretty amazing, actually. Um, it's not powdery, the chocolate. It's it's more kind of clumpy. 
I don't know, it might actually be kind of like a, a somewhat of a fresh ground cacao instead of a instead of a powder. Here we're mixing it up a bit. <laughs> I mean that is just that's a big lump of cacao powder right there. <laughs> But yeah, look at that, just getting chocolatey. And, oh, wow. This is going to be so good. Yeah. You know what? That actually cuts the sweetness down on this. It makes it... completely different experience and, and this experience I highly recommend this is absolutely phenomenal that is great I mean the chocolate isn't overpowering the egg and the egg isn't overpowering the chocolate and the coffee is just it's, it's like right in the background what a treat mm. All right, well, we're going to go find something to eat for our first meal here in Hanoi. I don't know what we're going to get, but I'm sure it's going to be amazing. So if you, when you walk out of Cafe Jiang and you turn left and walk to the corner, you will find Soy Yen. They serve sticky rice, and they do it really well from what I understand. So let's go check this place out. We are sitting here at Soy Yen. About to get some sticky rice. I just ordered a turmeric sticky rice mixed plate, so that should have a bunch of really good stuff involved in it. I think it's got some chicken, some pork, some eggs, some, some sausage. I'm not entirely sure what all we're gonna get, but we're gonna see when it gets here. So first we have some uh, looks like some cucumber salad there, and then some pork floss, some chicken. Some chicken skin, some charula. I'm not entirely sure what that is. An egg, and then underneath that should be some turmeric rice, and that just look amazing. Get into this. I don't even know what to expect. I mean, of course, it's going to be rice, but let's. Start out with some of this egg. Oh man, this is not the easiest thing in the world to, to get going on. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Nice big bite. Got some egg, got some rice. It's kind of bland, to be honest. Um, I think we're needing to add some of this to it. <laughs> See what that does for it. <laughs> this rice is hard to eat with this spoon. <laughs> All right, so. And we got some chicken and some rice and some of that pork floss. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, that changed the game completely. Try some of this uh, cucumber salad here. Yeah, that's that's nice. It's sweet. Got a little bit of a bite to it. Nice, crunchy, super fresh. Definitely, this is definitely worth eating here. Mm. All right, so this one we're gonna get a bit of that that chicken skin. Oh, yeah. 
got a nice crunchiness to it. Yeah, the more you dig into this meal, the, the tastier it gets. Let's see. This time we got some of that that mystery meat going on here. <laughs> if I can get it onto the spoon. All right, here we go. That was creamy, kind of like a pate. Excellent, though. absolutely fantastic. Vietnam does pate better than anywhere else in the world. You can take that to the bank. <laughs> I'm glad I came here. This, this wasn't originally on my radar. Um, on the research I've done for where I was going to make videos here, luckily I just had that one little extra spot that was right close to where I was. So we came here, we got this, and we're happy about it. Try some of this with the with the cucumber salad here. Mm. This is a great meal. I think it might have been easier with chopsticks, though. All right, let's try some of this, this chalua, the Vietnamese sausage. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Totally worth the price of admission. Oh, it looks like you know, we got some, some mung bean here, too, as well. Hmm. Some shallots. This place is awesome. The Soyen, right by the Jean Cafe. Yeah. Make a little brunch of it, I guess. <laughs> So go get yourself an egg coffee and then come here, get yourself some, some sticky rice and be satisfied for sure. The interesting thing about this egg is that it's, it was like hard boiled and then they shelled it and then deep fried it. And you can see it's kind of brown. Mm. Definitely a unique way to cook an egg. If you've enjoyed this video, go ahead and like, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you're into it. And as always, eat great food.